what's up? I wanted to do a six month review of my cheap Mako paint job on my 09 Silverado. This thing has 220,000 miles or something. And uh, it was a rust free truck, which is hard to come, from, come by in the, uh, in the Midwest. So um, it had been like keyed in the past, but it was, a, it was a clean truck. And just finding one where the, you know, the bed's still intact and it still has those wheel wells. So most people put those cheesy, um, like Amazon flares on them. And yeah, I just hate that. And I wanted a nice five, three, four wheel drive truck in the Midwest and it's hard with rust. So I picked this thing up and needed a paint job. And uh, I've had multiple Mako paint jobs in the past and everyone, you know, talks smack about them. And I would never use them for a high-end sports car or anything, but for something like this, it was perfect. So I ended up paying about a thousand bucks out the door for them to spray this thing. Um, it was, I wanna say maybe a week wait or so. So this thing had been keyed in the past and um, when I went to buy the truck, it just looked horrible. Um, so I brought it back and I did a bunch of the sanding and stuff myself to get those scratches down because if you were to spray over them, there'd be lines and everything. But um, I sanded the car down. I whenever I take something to Mako, I will remove the um, lights, some of the trim, and just put them like in the back seat because they will charge you for that if you want them to do it. Or if you take them, you know, take the vehicle to them with that stuff removed, the paint job's gonna look better because they're not gonna mask off the lights. So um, I took that stuff off. Um, and when I got it back, I was super happy with it. Uh, it, they have several stages of paint jobs, um, ranging from just like a basic single stage where it's just like the clear coats mixed in with the, the paint itself, or they have base coat clear coat and just steps all the way up. It can get very expensive, but um, you can get a car done for like 700 bucks. Just because this is a truck, it was uh, like 900 to 1,000. I ended up paying a little extra for them to take care of some of those deep gouges. Um, the truck does have... Um, the truck does have dings and stuff on it that I just didn't even care to take care of. It's just a cheap daily driver type deal, beater truck, um, take it fishing. So um, for a Midwest truck, I mean, my quick summary is the Mako paint job is great. Um, after six months in the Midwest through the salt and multiple car washes and, you know, auto washes and stuff, it's held up. It's not flaking off. It's not chipping off. Um, I don't see any failure points. Their masking job was pretty good. There's some overspray in a couple places. Um, but once again, it doesn't bother me. It looks, it looks way better than it did when I bought it. And, um, I, I mean, I have no real complaints about it. Uh, you just always hear those super negative remarks about Mako paint jobs, but when you finally have the discussion on an online forum or something, there's several people that are chime in and be like, Hey, I've had a bunch of those done and they're great for what you pay. Um, cause not everybody wants to pay five, six, $10,000 for a paint job on a car. That's only worth five, six grand, which is pretty much what one of these is worth now. It's just an old Silverado. So, um, I think for the money, the Mako paint job is a great option for just a daily driver. Um, if you, like I said, if you have a sports car that you really care about or it's a high dollar car, I would not recommend it. But um, for something like this, it's perfect. So that's my quick six month update on the Mako paint job. Um, and I recommend you get one as well. If you have a shoddy looking daily driver that maybe you want to color change or if you just want to uh, make it look nicer. Now, mind you, I did not do jams. So the door jams were not done in this. This car, this truck was like a gold color and um, I picked a newer silver. So when you open that door, the silver and the gold are very close. So you don't even notice that the jams were not done. So when you pay for something like jams and other things, it's gonna make your price go up. So this was a very simple, straightforward paint job.